Chess friends, this game is about Stockfish, 15 vs Alpha Zombie. What is Alpha Zombie? Well, a zombie version of Alpha Zero. Alpha Zombie have almost same coding as Alpha Zero 15 paper. I developed this brand new engine yesterday, that's why I didn't upload video last day. I know, watching Stockfish vs Leela Zero, Dragon Chess, and other chess engine games become a little boring thing. So, I decided to bring a big evaluation in YouTube chess videos. Alpha Zombie always play an unexpected move, like, his first move is h4, a4, very unexpected move. That's how I programmed it. Not only this, but I will make more zombie bots, like Magnus Zombie, zombie version of Magnus, Leela Zombie. If this video gets too many comments to continue this topic then I will make it. Watch the video and if you like this, zombie episode, then comment me, I will make more episodes of this topic. And, if you haven't subscribed our channel yet, then subscribe the channel to get more interesting content from us. Alpha Zombie always play an unexpected move, this is how I programmed it. I begins with E4. Zombie played d6, he can play like this, c5, knight f6. d4. Knight f6. Knight c3. He played c6. Black have many lines in his standard opening, he can play knight bd7, queen here and grab the center square. So, I played f4. Because I want to do long castle and push my king's side pawns with more confidently, because I am Stockfish, owner of Stockfish channel. Zombie played queen a5. Bishop d2. Queen b6. Knight f3. Bishop g4. e5. d takes e5. d takes e5. Knight d5. Knight a4. Queen c7. White have some good lines, you can play c4, h3 and bishop e2, but bishop e2 is slightly bad move, because why would you put your bishop on e2, because it doesn't create any big advantages because of this, put your bishop in a good square like c4. So, I played h3. Bishop, takes f3. Pawn takes bishop is not good because it's worst pawn structure, this move blocking the queen's entry line and these pawns together can't damage these pawns and the king. So, I played queen takes bishop, get active my queen. We have e6. Long castle. Knight bd7. King b1. Knight c5. You can take the knight, then bishop takes knight. c4, and knight e7. Knight takes c5 was available but I choose to play knight c3, keeping my only knight. Zombie played long castle. He didn't play short castle because these pawns are so advanced, I will push my pawns to create troubles for the king. Both side castled in a same square. Therefore I can't push my pawn, and also he will not push his pawns, because I have bishop pair to control these diagonals. And he have knight pair. So, I decided to break his knight pair. Knight takes d5. Rook takes d5. Bishop c4. Rook d4. Bishop e2. Bishop e7. c3. Rook d7. Bishop e3. a6. Rook d4. You shouldn't take the rook because of this, c takes d4. Knight here. Rook c1. Threatening this. You can't take the bishop, I will play rook takes e6, and nothing big. I just defeated the zombie which I always do, and saved the world. So, he played g6. We have rook c1. Rook hd8. g4. King b8. h4. Rook takes d4 c takes d4. knight a4. bishop f2. i can play f5 or queen b3. 
Knight b6. F5. If black do a big battle, then queen takes pawn. And your fh pawns are super weak, which will be very bad for black. I will get a past e pawn. So, alpha's zombie addition played h5. But best move was knight d5. Anyway h takes g5. You shouldn't take the h pawn because of this, you know what, you are weak in your own pawn structure with your own hand, and I will get an outside past pawn. So, he played g takes f5. Queen g2. Bishop b4. Bishop e3. Knight e5. Bishop g5. Rook h8. a3. Bishop f8. Bishop f3. We have queen a5. Rook g1. King a7. Queen f1. Queen b6. Queen goes to d3. Black's pieces are in pressure, he can't move his pieces frequently. I mean I forced a lot of zombies into a cage. Now you have to think about how to make black's position worse, it's easy. It's easy, just gradually improve your position, find a way to enter black's position, grab the weak pawns of black and create a pass pawn. I am sorry, I didn't show you the arrow lines. Anyway queen c2. f4. Queen c1. Queen b6. Bishop, takes d5. c takes d5. Queen c3. Rook takes h5. Rook f1. Queen b5. Rook f3. Queen c6. Queen takes c6. b takes c6. Rook takes f4. I am winning because, it's target the pawn, and I have passed h pawn. King is very close to stop these pawns. Zombie played rook h7. Bishop f6. c5. Rook g4. c takes d4. Rook g8. Bishop h6. King c2. King b6. h5. King c5. Rook c8 check. A4 check. You can't take the pawn, because rook b8 will seize the file, threatening bishop e7. Then rook b4 check. King goes to a5. King b3, and will be made by the bishop, game will be over. So he played king b6. Rook g8. Bishop f4. Rook h8. The zombie can't escape from there so d3 check by a zombie. King takes zombie. Rook takes h8. Bishop takes h8. Bishop h6. The bishop have to stay on this square, otherwise I will promote the pawn as I promised. Bishop f6. Subscribe the channel to get more interesting content from us. Let me put your brain power improving piano music. Wish you all the best. Thanks for watching subscribe for more. Bye bye. Take care. See you in my next video.